Hey everybody, Sean Tubbs here with Rev Amplifiers and I'm hanging out at Sweetwater and we're going to be checking out the Rev uh, D20. This is a 20 watt 6v6 driven amplifier. It is an all tube amplifier. So the D20 comes preloaded with six two notes uh, Dyne IRs. And you can choose between those on the front of the amplifier. Now these are uh, preloaded and set, but you can change those IRs to anything you want. And also keep in mind, uh, within the two notes uh, software, you can also load your own uh, third party impulse responses. And, uh, and the sky's really the limit. You can have anywhere from six to as many as you want employing uh, the two notes uh, embedded software. As I mentioned, it's a single channel amplifier. It's very uh, pedal friendly. It definitely has uh, that pedal platform uh, tonality to it, but it also sounds really rich and beautiful just on its own, and that's how we're gonna check it out. So uh, right now I've got it dialed uh, fairly clean. Um, and yeah, we'll just we'll just take a listen. So right now there's just a little bit of breakup. If I really dig into it, but it's relatively clean and punchy. Now I can make it cleaner. We can roll the gain back just a little bit and maybe the volume back just a little bit and it'll clean up. So if you're wanting to use pedals, you can, you can run it that way. It's still very responsive to touch. And right now I will uh, mention that we are running it in the 20 watt mode. You can switch it all the way down to four watts if you wish, but we're going to keep it in the 20 watt uh, mode for the purposes of this demo. Um, we have a uh, bass, mid, and treb EQ, so I'm just going to roll that really quick. Here's treble. Gets pretty chimey and sweet. We can go quite a bit darker. Now, what this amp has uh, that a lot of amps that are in this voicing uh, don't normally have or characteristically wouldn't have is a mid control. So I'll roll that really quick. Right now it's at noon. You can roll it all the way up and it gets pretty fat. And it also adds gain. So if you want the amp to sound a little more pushed. Sounds really nice with that. You can roll it all the way back the other way. You want it to be kind of chimey and just sweet. I like it pretty much at noon. And then uh, the bass, we can shut that all the way off. The bass is pretty big sounding on this. Pretty just that American, it's, it's not loose, but it does have that big kind of pillowy feel to it. And then of course, this volume on the end uh, is a master volume, but obviously as you crank that up and down, it will drive uh, the power tube, so that's going to create gain as well. So if I go a little louder with that, if I turn it back down, not quite as much gain there. Same thing on the neck. You can turn that down a bit not as much power to break up, but that's where uh, the amp uh, comes in at being very, very expressive because what I'm going to do is turn on the crunch mode. Now this isn't a crunch channel, but it is a mode and it allows you to get kind of a, uh, kind of a beefy crunch sound. So I'll go ahead and turn that on. And that's just simply by pulling the gain pot. Now, if I want that to have a little bit more 
uh, push and some just like bite in the upper end. I can turn the treble up, maybe some more mids, maybe roll the bass down, and we'll add just a little bit more volume here. And it's that very kind of vintage, just pushed crunch tone. from that crunch sound all the way back to that really sweet, clean, more kind of pedal friendly platform tone. So that is the Rev D20. I really appreciate you guys checking out this video. If you've got any further questions about the Rev D20 or any other Rev uh, products, please reach out to your Sweetwater sales engineer.